With Instyro, you have so many choices of particle size, and the particle size is determined by the screen size. This is a screen insert for the shredder, also here. We have many sizes of screens. Big giant inch and a half size for making patent peanuts, down to, oh, we have an eighth inch size. This is about a one quarter inch size. So you can see the particles have to pass through a screen this size before they exit our shredder and they go on to our separator. When they hit our separator, they hit another screen and another vacuum pole on that screen. So they are once again separated into fines and biggers. So if we use the big screen to make packing peanuts over here, we'll use the big screen to separate off fines over here. What we're left is a medium-sized material up to about three-eighths of an inch as our fine material. That's kind of a leftover in the packing peanut system. And what comes out of the separator here is a great packing peanut. You know, stuff in this size range of foam, shredded well, and uh, not very staticky. All the little pieces are sent off to the separator. Those little pieces are useful too for things like concrete aggregate, uh, making a soil modifier to make your soil lighter, um, green roofing for that matter, and many other uses, stuffings for bean bags, that type of thing. Um, there are a lot of new and up and coming uses for a very quality leftover from the packing peanut system. But most people who make the packing peanuts either want to use or sell the packing peanuts. That's that system. With concrete aggregate, you can make an elite concrete aggregate by getting the size range right. Maybe this is your large particle size. If your largest particles had to pass through this screen, so they're only about a quarter inch in size. When they leave this shredder, everything's less than a quarter of an inch. And some of those particles are so small and fine, they attract too much water in concrete. So we get rid of those with our separator. We put in a small screen. Now, the, the airflow, which is also necessary to the system, pulls the fine materials through this screen, and then the separator separates out the large ones. And those large ones are perfect for concrete. They have the surface area to grip the cement paste because of the shredder, because they've been torn and they have a rough surface. They're not like a smooth, round bead, which is awful for concrete. They are a shredded bead, and they are smooth, I mean, they're not smooth. They have a surface area to grip the paste, and removing the fines makes it workable on concrete. The fines actually draw so much water. When used in concrete, they stop the flow of concrete. We remove those and only give you the perfect particles for concrete. It really changes the game when it comes to styrofoam and concrete. And that's where Instyro started, but we will make any screen sizes for just about any reason, and there are new reasons all the time. Styrofoam recycling is just starting. The time of melting down styrofoam is gone. Let's use it for its value, not melt it and ship it. It's crazy. Let's do it the right way. Thanks for viewing. Have a great day.